Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I take care of my dog. So I'm going to show you how I clip his nails and I brush his teeth and just how I get rid of some of his, some of his dog hair so he doesn't shed as much. Um, yeah, so if you want to see how I take care of my dog, just keep watching. Okay, so the first thing is um, you'll need some sort of mitt or brush. And this is, I love pet head, so I got this at, I believe it's PetSmart. And it's got two sides, um, and, and you can stick your hand in there. And you really want to use the rubber part that has these little bristles. Um, this is Bentley. Say hi, Bentley. Look, look, say hi. This way. Look it. Alright. Here. Okay. So I have a boxer. Bentley's a boxer and he's about five years old. Um, and so all you want to do is this will take off the hair really well. If you see he's he's got like little hairs on the, the top of his coat. And he's an inside dog, so we don't really want that flying around the house. So we're just gonna brush him and he really likes it. It's like getting a massage for him. He's really good at staying still. And I don't know if you can see, there's there's hair there. And uh, you're just gonna brush him and get rid of that hair and your dog will shed less inside your house. Um, of course, if you have a dog with longer hair, um, you're gonna have to get a different brush, but this one works for Bentley. So there's that. All right, and then next is I'm going to show you how to brush his teeth. Now, this is going to save you some money um, at the vet because uh, they charge you for this, and it's expensive. So the thing, you want to get some toothpaste at first that has some sort of flavoring. So this has some sort of, okay, um, it has peanut flavor, and you know dogs love peanut butter. So this toothbrush has dual sides, and um, I'm going to use the, the bigger side. So we've been doing this for about two weeks. So I'm going to put the, the toothpaste right on the toothbrush like that. Bentley. And so what you want to do is, because they don't like toothbrushes, you want to let them lick it first so they can taste it. So can you see that? Okay. So he's used to me doing this. We've been doing this uh, about twice a week for the last two weeks. And then now I'm going to go in with the toothbrush and he's just going to kind of chew on it while I get in there and, and brush, brush his teeth. And at first, they're probably only going to want the toothpaste. <laughs> Anytime you can get in there and brush your teeth brush their tea, they're getting some of that tartar off, so you can pay less at the vet, right? All right, so the last thing I'm going to show you is how to cut their nails, and this you can buy at um, also at Pet. Okay, the last thing we're going to do is we're going to cut his nails with this little nail cutter, and uh, you can purchase this at any Pet Smart or Pet Store, um, and I'm going to show you I know a lot of people are afraid of cutting their nails, but um, if you look at their nails underneath, you can see where the quick is. So as long as you, you keep the cutting right before that, um, you'll be fine. And you can tell actually where the quick is, especially on the white nails. He doesn't really like to have his nails cut. I don't think any dogs do. So. Uh, this is really easy to use, so you're just going to put his nail in there like this, and um, and they'll let you know. All right, look it. And, all right, Bentley. And then you cut. And so you can tell this nail is cut. And then so 
If you can't see or you get nervous, you can always cut a little bit at a time. The black one, I always make sure I look underneath to make sure you're only cutting the end. And cut. And if you do cut too much, they will bleed. Um, they do sell antiseptic. You're not going to kill your dog, but it does hurt them. Um, and they do sell an antiseptic to put on there. Um, so, and you just do one by one. And you cut that and it works really well. So, um, so yeah, those are monies that, those are ways that you can save money um, at the vet because I know they charge to cut their nails as well. So remember to keep your dog out of the heat um, when it's really hot outside. Watch their paws. If it's too hot on the cement for you, it's too hot for them too. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye, guys.